Let's talk about the GOP and their reaction to student loan debt relief, which is a wonderful thing because anybody who's been in that cycle knows you're sending in a monthly payment and it's only going to interest. I've been there myself for decades, okay? So what Biden has done is a good thing. And how is the right reacted to it? The way they always react to anything that has to do with compassion and equanimity, right? With hatred and rancor. It's forgiveness. Aren't you supposed to be Christians? Isn't that one of the tenets of Christianity, right? Christianity only works when they're manipulating the base. They're not real Christians. They're not real spiritual people. They're kleptocrats. They're trying to keep people down so they can continue to steal from them. That's what the GOP does. Trump's relationship with debt is one of a guy who never pays it, right? He had, what is it, $700 million worth of debt in 2008, right? It was coming due. He started missing his payments. He got extensions. He missed those. This is for Deutsche Bank's loan to him for Chicago Trump Tower. So what does he do? He turns around and sues the bank for $3 billion. Why? Because he's rich enough to afford lawyers who will take on these bullshit cases because they can get billable hours. You know, Trump's an idiot, but he pays the bills. So they do this. The bank sort of recoils and relieves $287 million worth of debt for Trump. So when everybody else was losing their homes, he was getting out of what he owed legitimately. His whole life has been about debt. His father built his apartments from no interest and low interest FHA loans that he got as part of the New Deal. Democratic socialism, right? Designed to build housing for GIs coming back from World War II. Trump's dad used it to fill his own pockets, cheat on his taxes, and launder money for the mob. And Trump took that business model and put it on steroids. And now he's got an entire party spewing hate, trying to keep their own people down so they can continue to grift. All you have to do is look at their relationship with PPP loans to see that. They all lined up like it was a trough and fed off the government teat and then didn't pay it back. So screw them and screw their hatred and go Brandon.